Hello, Saga Soul here, and welcome back to Pally of Pines. Agami has something to say. Ah, just the person I'm hoping to run into. The other day I promised Mary and whip up a classic recipe potato, carrot, and spring onion stew. Only I'm out of potatoes, and carrots, and spring onions. To tell you the truth, I was thinking about something else when I made a promise. Anyway, gonna need you to rustle all those up for me. I'll get them. Anyway, I can continue. Run and grab those and get back here. Quick shower if you know what's good for ya. So we have to go and get some veg some uh, veggies for uh, Granny Agami, I already have the carrots and potatoes. We just need the um, the spring onions. Well, hopefully they are ready soon. I don't actually know. Hmm. When it's starting to become evening, so we're going to go ahead and head back to the ranch. And now we're this evening. There's nothing more that I can do right now, so we might as well just go ahead and skip to the next day. All the crops are oh yeah, right. How are the spring onions doing? Seedling. Oh they are all still just seedlings. And so is the potato. It's gonna take a few days. How how long does the spring onion take? Five days. Okay. So shouldn't be too long. And seeing as it is day five and I think we planted them a couple of them were planted day one, so they should be ready. Right, I think the dinos are happy, all good. Yeah. Right. Uh sleepy time. Three crops are ready to harvest. That will be the uh, first spring onions. And you need attention. Not enough food in the front. Oh we can we can fix that. There you go. Anything else? You, you can use some pets. Pet you. Do a little dance. And pet peaches. And then I'll give them all a carrot each. And carrot. <laughs> and a carrot for you. And a carrot for Minty. Minty, here. Have a carrot. Mm. To water some plants. And hit the bit. Good gully, my miss. It's not a lot of spring onions, but it should do. Okay, we can only complete one quest. And now that's all is sticky. Flowering potato. These will be done in a couple of days. Right. Mm, 
okay, you can help me clear the stuff up. You're about to level as well. Uh, let's let's clean this up. of spring cleaning. Oh, these spring onions are already one star onions. Cool. Of course, that's because of the season. It's the right season to grow spring onions. Forgot about that. Okay, I have no oh, right over there, <laughs> off in the corner. There, there's Minty. Okay, let's go and uh, leave these veggies to um, either Pippin or Gami. Not sure which. I think Agami, that'll unlock cooking. It'll unlock cooking if we give them to her. Oh, right. New person. We'll go say hello to them then. Go say hello to them then. <laughs> wow. How are you doing on those vegetables to pull? <laughs> How are you doing for those vegetables for me? I got them. I like the way you work it. Hot diggity. Why don't you bag them up? Hold your head resource. We're not done yet. You ever learn how to cook? No? You mean you've been eating raw potatoes and uncooked onions since you moved in? I haven't actually eaten at all. So... Love a young lumberjack. Cook is the best part about growing your own veg. Buckle up, buttercup, because it's learning time. Okay, you should already see that cooking pot next to Ovin's like. Take these ingredients, I rustle up, and head on over there. But, but I... I... Okay. I took the liberty of sticking the recipe in your journal while you weren't looking. She's a sneaky one, Granny. Best for you. Uh, the, the, the. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Best thing about Classic Stew is that it's almost impossible to get wrong. It's a good starter recipe. You'll learn others, but you'll never learn better. Now hop to it. Yeah, not yet. I'm gonna go say hello to this person. If you're interested, I could experiment with some color. Could be a whole new look for you. But I'd still look like Pippin, wouldn't I? Of course you would. What I was envisioning. Oh, hello Saga. Who's this? A new friend of yours, Pippin? A new friend of everyone. Saga just moved in the, into that old ranch in the valley. Inspired, you are giving off former... Shy... I, I don't really know how to pronounce that last word, so we're gonna go with that. Saga, meet Rani. She's a traveling stylist, seamstress, tra tailor, and trimmer. Did, did I leave anything out? Not a thing, Pippin. As a Rani, the whole package tied with a vibrant bow. Charmed, Saga. I sense the carefree vibes of a fellow traveler in her midst. There's nothing quite like the freedom of starting fresh with no more than the clothes on your back. Yippee! <laughs> Yippee! <laughs> Speaking of clothes, hmm, how open are you to change? Hair? Outfit? Accessories? Colors? Like what I like? Oh, a cryptic answer with plenty of possibilities to play with. I like what I'm feeling. Catch me passing through Pebble Plaza from time to time with all sorts of exciting energy in tow. 
let me know if you need anything at all from a subtle shift to an extreme makeover. Come say hi before you leave the plaza, okay? Hey dear honey pie, thanks for swinging by. Feeling a new vibe? Something driving you in? Oof, it's hard to look this good when all that rope dust gets everywhere, but I manage. There's nothing better than waking up every morning in a new place, it's so inspiring. You travel a lot? Mm, that keeps me close up. Of course it must, honey pie. I can't imagine. A trek to Pally Pies must have been a trip of a lifetime. I don't blame you for settling for a while. But don't be afraid to leave the valley when you can. It's a big world out there. So, Urani, well, as mentioned, she'll. Uh, Make sure that there are clothes. You can buy clothes from her and change up your style. You can, e can even... Uh, you can, can uh, change everything except eye color. Funny, <laughs> which is a little funny. Like, <laughs> hair... Oh. Eye and skin color you can't change. You can change the hair if you so want. So if I wanted I could run around with uh, purple hair and eyebrows. Or, or green. But I like the color I have. Stay stylish sugar. Sugar. However you say it. I like her, she's very chill. No, I'm not going to give the onions you, not yet. Then I will have to wait for more onions. I did not want to sit on the bench, I wanted to look at the board. Uh, yeah, I can do that. I can do that. I can do that. And that. Probably that. I cannot do that. Oh. Heading to the edge of the valley. Heard strange noises over yonder late last night. Gotta have a peek. Could you do me a favor? You bring this to Owen if you get a chance. I am headed that way, so yeah. That's part of Owen's lunch. Owen was supposed to come with me earlier, but... <sighs> He's caught up in writing one more thing. That boy really needs to get out from behind the desk. Can't wait any longer. Investigation awaits. Right after I finish packing. Have an exciting day. Right, so we have to deliver bell peppers, I think it was. Yeah. Have to deliver some bell peppers as well. Just as well as I'm headed that direction. Hey Oven, I have lots of stuff to hand over to you. Oh, hello Saga. Be right with you, just one more thing to finish up. Mary's looking for you. Mary? Uh, oh no, we were supposed to- Don't tell me she left without me. The day's barely started, could she wait five minutes? <sighs> Maybe it's for the best. She can dive in and I don't have to rush. Oh, she did promise to bring me lunch. I got it. Oh, she gave you the peppers? Y you know what? You keep them. All this adrenaline has wiped out, out my appetite. So, yeah, uh, now we have bell peppers. Juicy and crunchy. Let's see if peaches like them. No, not potato. That's not what I want to give. Okay, so my inventory is actually full. Little bit, bit of an issue. <laughs> Then, uh, so because of that, I am going to drop off 
the saddle for now. I can just go come by and pick it up again later. Let's do some cooking. To make the classic seals, I yeah. So we gotta do some experimenting. We'll, and we'll start by adding 10 potatoes. I do wish you could uh, write in the number instead of just clicking. <laughs> but, hmm. Uh, next, we'll add 15 spring onions. You can also hold, but it's it's low. Oh, you can't hold. Huh. Maybe I'm mixing that up with something else. Yeah, possible. And 20 carrots. It's a lot of carrots. Gonna cook it and it'll tell us when. Basically, when it starts bubbling up, that is when you have to click. So, again, inventory is full. Now we have to go back and give this due to Agami. Here, one portion of classic stew. Now you know the basics, don't be afraid to experiment from time to time. Sure, you may end up with some catastrophes, but no harm in trying new things. Here, take another recipe. A little tip from me to you. Everyone loves a fresh cooked meal on their budding day. Anyway, I should be getting this over to Mary. She loves it when I cook for her. But I cooked it! Gami, why you be like this? <laughs> Grandma, Grandma, why? So, it is the next in-game day and Peaches, the Styracosaurus, is now a helper. So, we're gonna get a saddle from storage and go put it on her. And then we'll finally be able to remove... Okay, we're gonna take care of this. Yuck. Oh, there's, there's more. Minty, please. Don't do that. And now they're happy, so that's all the poop. Here you go. And now we can smash rocks. Which, of course, is a great source of stone. Now we can finally cl start to clear out the ranch a little bit more. And another thing that the Styracosaurus can do is till the earth. So, you see this mess? Let me just... Here you go. Really useful. Ah, out of stamina. But, as I mentioned in the past, there is a way to gain stamina back. And that is to feed them the poppin they like. Now, I really shouldn't do this with a low level. But I, I got money, I can just buy more. Here we feed a Yuzu Poppin and boom! Max stamina, so we can go ahead and till the rest. Which is so much faster. And cute. And, and what's more important than cute? Until a few extra spots. And then we got the last few over here. 
Now that we have our Stereocosaurus buddy, that means that we can unlock Dapplewood. And of course, don't forget, give your new dino friend, dino friend a good pat and a treat. Tell them that they've done a good job. Just like that, full happiness. Uh, we had seeds. Seed, seed, seed. Yep. Got lots of potato and carrots, and we got a little bit of spring onion. So, we got mainly soft earth. Got some sticky fertilizer. So we shall plant a couple of carrots here. That will be a zero star carrot, but these will be uh, two star carrots because it's the right soil and it has been fertilized. And over there we have a special Stereocosaurus, the Sunday Stereocosaurus. This coloration is guaranteed to spawn on Sundays. Just like you may have spotted a interesting coloration of Stereocosaurus earlier. That is a Saturday Stereocosaurus and they are guaranteed to spawn on Saturdays. I didn't get it because I don't have a use for them just yet and I don't have a lot of space but that'll change soon soon speaking of things changing we can now break this boulder over here But there's not really any reason to do so quite yet. If we open up the path to Dapplewood, however, things will happen. Not a lot, except for an entirely new area to explore, but some things shall happen. Pippin still needs those onions. Is Pippin going to ask about onions if I try to complete a quest I <laughs> dread for Ragami? Can I give you a notebook or are you gonna ask about onions? Oh, it wasn't a notebook, it was a lucky trinket. There we go. Cool. And now we can go and... Uh, Finish that quest. Anything? No. Not sure why I checked. I know there's nothing. Don't have garlic. Sure. Sure. These I can just do off camera. Peach just does not have enough energy to deal with that right now, but we can start. We do need to hit it one more time. I do have a poppin. Mm, yeah, we, we might as well, right?
great Kelly Mimus, I was starting to think I'd never see that wood again. Saga, I knew you were a genius from the first moment I saw you. And your wee friend here is not half bad looking either. <laughs> oh, what a delight, what a weight off my shoulders. My workshop, the sawdust, is gonna be flying. My veggie farm must look like a Trodon's dinner. I shudder to think what poke has been nibbling on while I've been away. Ah, and we Willem and Squillem will have torn the place to ribbons. No time to lose. <laughs> Come on, Granny. But truly, thank you. Please come visit when you get a chance. I can thank you properly. Yes, yes, me too. Now come on, Rollo. You're slower than us. Oh, I really want to go there right now, but I think we should save that for the next video. And I honestly don't know how long I've been going for. I haven't been keeping a track. So we'll save Dapple Wood for the next video, which I am very excited about, to be honest. Instead, we will go to the other side of the valley and break some more rocks. And you'll see why. Although it just occurred to me that I would need more fencing and more space. If I were to go do that. Okay, I'll, I'll open up the path. And then we'll see what we do. Did I have any delivery for... No, I don't... Uh... Search around the room. Ah, right. I'll, like I said, I'll go and do all that off camera. Here we got some boulders to break through. And an entirely new path has opened up. Now this leads into the desert area. Though this is still part of Viridian Valley. Here we have the Ankylosaurus with cute common colorings. Oh, yeah, t careful. We'll, we'll, sh we'll check back another day and see if there are any uncommons or maybe even rares. Maybe even ultra rare. You never know. You never know. We got a more coffee color Pachycephalosaurus and a big boulder to break to get to them. Actually, they look different. Are they different kinds of coffee? Can I just check? Now you may wonder how do I just run up to them with the book? No, that's not going to work. We, we have to put them to sleep first. <laughs> ow, 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 ow. So cute. They 
are so cute. It hurts. And from the uh, radar, the, the thingy, they look pretty easy to befriend once you have the flavor they like. Right. What are you? Coffee rose. Okay. Just an uncommon one. So the other one's the rare one. I, th I think, at least. Double check. Hey, hey, hey. The other one's still asleep up there. Zeus, go to sleep. Go to sleep. You're sleepy, Pachycephalosaurus. And there it goes. And you are. Oh! Just coffee, just uncommon. Huh. Could have sworn they were rare. Maybe there's a different coffee one I'm thinking of. Because there's several cof coffee coloring of the packies. <laughs> there's coffee, rose coffee apparently, and I've seen light coffee, and that one is rare. There's probably also dark coffee. If I were to guess. Here's a lot. And do, do I have spe- oh yeah, I do. <laughs> Barely. Got a lot of stone. Which I don't really need, I don't need that much stone. But over here, there should be a large dreamstone. Yes, there is. And another tablet fragment. Ready to get some more stone? <laughs> Let me just say, once you have a Styracosaurus as a helper, stone is not going to be a problem ever again. <laughs> oh, okay. Can can I fit through that? I cannot fit through that gap, so we have to take the long way around in anyways. Well, that's gonna have to do it for this video though. It just hit evening and there's not much more we can do for this day and it's starting to get quite long. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video, thank you for watching and I shall see you next time in Dapplewood. Bye bye!